Especially with how last episode ended, this one being called Adversity doesn't make me happy. Like, can we just get a, a nice and simple dub and not get sneak attacked? What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again. Last episode, we had all of our magic knights ended up getting transported by an insanely strong spatial magic user because they were lured there by the zombies. That was Rodas' whole objective in being there. Um, we also had the witch versus Yuno, who, they, because she was hitting him with so many curses, he was losing his senses, and because he was backed in a corner, and because he was blind, he was forced to, uh, like, attune, he was forced to be able to detect the mana and magic around him. It was, his detection was so precise and fine now if you guys want to clarify specifically to me what happened there just so i know i am just assuming that because he was so attuned to the mana around him that he was able to connect with sylph on a different level so that's why he was able to use her magic or was it something else i'm not you know no spoil you know no spoilers obviously but i'm just i don't want to be uh, i just don't want to sound stupid but i appreciate anything you guys do give me remember any information remember we are four episodes ahead on patreon early access and i just enabled the annual subscription if you guys want to subscribe for a whole year you get a i'm pretty sure a two month or at least a month discount on that so make sure to check that out guys always is appreciated and if you guys want to support and patreon's not really your thing if you guys could just leave a like and a nice comment for the youtube algorithm i am i appreciate you oh so much your support is also very appreciated even though i just said that let's hop into this black clover episode 25 adversity are we back with charmy yeah i could tell we're back with charmy immediately munch it munch it munch it munch it they were probably flabbergasted that she was able to eat all that. As a chef, that's all you can ask for. Someone that was just willing to eat all of your food. Right? That's probably the question that needs to be asked. Oh, are we going to see Charmy in action? Is she going to have food magic? Oh, the witch. Oh, oh, I knew she was an old hag. But the wind spirit magic really did fuck her up. Wow. Self's breath. So did he use some... Did you know use... Hmm. Oh, because she sucks the mana of others. Like, she's constantly sucking mana. She needs an excess, an abundance to be able to make herself look young. So, with Yuno's blindness, he was so more attuned to the flow of mana. He could detect the mana going around there. Then, was he able to suck that in? Is that what it was? Because she's, like, out. Which, she could be out, like, being defensive from his attack, or is she out because he just like, no, bitch, no, bitch. I'm just curious. Let me know. You're not going to take Charmy's mana. Relax, lady. <laughs> Do you think she means food? I wanted to see her use some magic. He's, like, flying with Sylph now. That's so cool. Oh, her mana's is increasing by a lot. Oh, you fuck with Charmy's food. It's a wrap for you. Well, I was completely joking about food magic, but what? Cotton creation magic. Oh, I do remember that. She didn't make those sheep. Yeah. Strike of the sleeping sheep. I love the sound effect, but bitch, you got Mike Tyson. All right, note to self. Don't fuck with Charmy. <laughs> they captured her. Good. I'm gonna go ahead and say no. Does her mana, when empty, does it return back to the original owners? I, I fucking hope so. Thank the Lord. Okay. Well, that's a happy ending on that. I she was I thought she was bodying people. Okay. Imagine getting your youth back. Sheesh. Imagine having saggy titties for like five minutes. But oh, my noms. You know he's gonna save it with his wind magic, right? Hey, Charmy, you help me out. You take care of the witch. I'll save your food. That's what we help. We're black bull. Oh, never mind. I'm a golden don. I still help you out. I completely forgot. You know, it's just a part of the team. You know. 
which I've noticed from a lot of the Black Bulls, they're not weak. They're literally just weirdos. They're really strong, but they're all weirdos. Finally, Yuno has his first girl. The Asta harem is no more. Okay, maybe it could have been Asta if Asta saved her food. Oh, he's not even paying attention right now. I, I want to hear Sylph talk. I want to watch. She's still just chilling. Uh, uh. That does come in clutch. Being able to create cotton, a cotton bed. Yeah. Good question, Noel. Wow, he was right there, but how did he know? That's crazy. So he used the disguise to look like a zombie, but he's not the definitely not the one to meet up with Fogolian on the spot. He's only sending him there. I like his design. So it's like Kuragiri from My Hero. We have teleportation. He's not dead. There's no way. There's no way. I was like an arm ripped off. I was like, okay, gone. But maybe we could heal that with some magic. There's some like it's like it's like Hunter Hunter. That I, that's doable. But there's no way. I mean, yeah, he seems like such a good man and such a good big bro. Okay, okay, so the grimoire uh, disappears or disintegrates or breaks apart once they die? That's insane. He's still alive. Yeah, we need him healed ASAP. There's got to be a magic we can get his arm... I'm heated. I was just talking about trying to take a dub and be happy. I knew it wasn't going to happen, but I definitely wasn't expecting this. I want to know who was in the fucking room with him. Absorb magic. Absorb the magic. Long range right now. Yep. Think calmly. Wow, he really is absorbing the advice from Fogolian. Come on. What can you do? Yes. And then if he cuts through the magic from a long range. Oh, he threw it. That's even smarter. Genius. Now you're stuck here, Radas. Oh, I thought he cut his head clean off. We're just going to Mike Tyson the fuck out of him straight. Give him the one, two. Come on. Valtos. That true. True. Oh, Leopold, come on. Your brother needs you. That's my boy. Step it up, bro. Come on. I know how you feel. This is not right. Your brother would be pissed at you. I need, I need to know who was in that room. Oh, uh, we have somebody higher than these guys, and then we have his master on top? I gotta know everyone. Who is this? Us is still bleeding. Yeah, that's actually insane. You could really bleed out, lose consciousness so quick. She seems like a toga type character. Crazy girl. 
Slightly. Oh, he cut his skin to turn them from curse cuts to normal cuts. I mean, it's not going to worsen it much. It's actually only going to make it better. I don't know how I didn't think of that at all. <laughs> He's so stupid. Adversity, title. Plug the show. Plug the title. Normally I'd be mad, but I'm about to watch this next episode right now, so... Jesus Christ. I'm shocked at, like, how little I reacted to Fuegolian right there, because I was just so taken back. I don't know, I was so expecting for us to have a reveal, because you gotta think, 25 episodes in? That's a good time for a reveal, you know? Like, at, around this time, Naruto, we were just about to meet Orochimaru, you know? Like, I'm waiting for a new big bad. This is a new big bad territory time, so I'm just like... I'm like, okay, we saw Valtos. I'm like, that's cool. The We saw the Kurogiri, but we need to see the um, fucking... Uh, what is his name? How am I forgetting? Shigaraki. We, we have the Kuragiri, we just need to see, do we need to see the Shigaraki of the squad, but no, we, we can't, like, oh, and then he just sent him back with, I was like, okay, he lost his arm, he's fine, you know, like, in a world full of magic, and a world of Hunter Hunter, and a world of Star Wars, you can lose an arm, and we can live, it's not like our current world where an amputated limb is, like, a horrible sentence, you know, it's like, it might be a very livable in this or at least i would assume but then i saw like the glaziness of his eyes and i was like no he's dead there's no way but then i assumed then i was i was confused because he's alive which is good that's what i wanted but they said they got what they needed and then when he asked when fogolian said why are you here he said for you so he needed something with fogolian did he just get information was it his blood because he has royal blood but then why would they go for fogolian specifically why would they not go for somebody like leopold who's easier to capture or someone like noel or mimosa for that matter does it have to be a certain high up but then they were able to use spatial magic on all the silvas why not get nozzle nebra or uh solid you know like i'm very curious why specific why specifically fuegolian and i'm very curious what they got out of him because they got what they needed i might get some answers here in this next episode i'm about to watch it right here especially i thought when the fog came in and five people were there i thought it was going to be one person who uses like fog clone magic was just like making him seem like he was more intimidated with numbers but we have five very advanced very unique all different magic users who are ready to sh fuck shit up so them plus radez plus voltos versus a weakened asta uh disheveled leopold and a already have fought in noel so this is in a, in a half dead fogolian you know this is very dire of a situation but I'm definitely going to watch it. So if you guys want to watch it with me, check out that early access down in the Patreon down below. Don't forget to follow all my socials at Dapper Darius. Thank you guys so much for watching. On to the next episode. This was super good.